anyone what is an electric dipole covered in chemistry electric dipole yes positive charge and negative charge separated by some distance so first part is what is an electric dipole molecule in a molecule it is possible that the center of the positive charge does not coincide with the center of a negative charge. So, negative charge and positive charge are separated by some distance and overall molecule is neutral that means what value of the negative charge magnitude wise is same as that of a positive charge. Whenever you have some negative charge some positive charge separated by some distance say 2L. Why 2L? We will have reason when we have derivation next two three questions. Any distance R between the two it is in this case 2L. Then this is termed as electric dipole. What is an electric dipole? Electric dipole is system of a yes it is a system of two equal and opposite charges separated by some distance. Application part in chemistry molecule distances are of what order? Few angstrom. Distance between positive charge and negative charge will be of order of few angstrom. One, the distance between the charges is called length of the dipole. In this case, length of the dipole is how much? 2L. Two minutes to write this part. What is an electric dipole? B part electric dipole moment now we need to have quantitative that means numerical part of the same electric dipole moment magnitude s p is equal to charge into yes distance between the two distance between the two is given so what is the magnitude of electric dipole moment charge into distance between the two next whether it is a scalar quantity or a vector quantity it is a vector quantity having direction check from negative to positive so p as a vector is equal to magnitude of p into direction magnitude is how much q into 2l direction is what from negative to positive what is p it is a unit vector from minus q to plus q means it is from negative towards positive two minutes with you to write two minutes to write one more question board what is electric dipole units yes anyone si units charge into distance. SI unit for charge is coulomb, for distance is meter. So, it is coulomb meter. Write down coulomb into meter. Coulomb for coulomb, this has to be capital, otherwise, it appears to be centimeter. Fine. It is coulomb into meter.
or an electric dipole. When you have electric dipole, its symmetry is there is a negative charge, there is a positive charge. Field lines start from positive, end up at a negative. So, the lines are like this start from positive, end up at a negative. This appears to be a if it is some distance it appears to be a, a cylinder. So, in one of the question in competition, the question was the symmetry is of what type? Is it a sphere, a cylinder or what? Answer is it is a cylinder. So, Q 1 plus Q 2, whenever you have Q 1 plus Q 2 is equal to 0 means what? Magnitude of the two charges are equal and one is positive, the other is a negative. Symmetry is of what type? This arrangement symmetry is what? Yes, it is a cylinder. Symmetry is cylindrical. Part C, what does Q1 plus Q2 equal to 0 signify? What is an ideal dipole? Ideal dipole. Chemistry. Charge minus 1, this is plus 1. Distance between the two is very, very small. Of what order? Of the order of a angstrom. So, ideal dipole is charge is high, value, numerical value is high. Distance is small. That is something which will act as a ideal dipole. One minute with you to write. No. Double of what? 12, the purpose is to come out of the center. So, that for calculation it is easy to mark L. Double of what? That is our mathematical convenience. You will see next two questions. 2L will help you. an electron and proton are separated by 10 angstrom. Find electric dipole moment. Two minutes with you to try. negative charge minus q plus q distance between the two two l yes given is what charge yes electron proton magnitude of the charge yes 1.6 into 10 raised to power minus 19 coulomb distance between the two two l is what 10 angstrom 1 angstrom is equal to what? 10 raised to power minus 10 meters. You have to find out what? Electric dipole moment, both magnitude as well as direction. Magnitude is equal to what? Magnitude of P, step 1, is equal to charge into distance. Solve it. Charge into distance. What is the value for charge? Yes, 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19. What is the value for distance 2L? 
10 into 10 is power minus 10. 10 is to power minus 9. Comes out to be what? 1.6 into 10 is to power minus 28 units. Yes. Charge into distance. Coulomb meter. Direction. Yes. What is the direction for electric dipole? Electric dipole moment from negative to positive. From electron, objective question, to proton. From negative charge to positive charge. From electron to proton. Refer to page 1 by 65, numerical number 10. Numerical number 10 is charge Q1 plus 6 nano coulomb is on y axis at y is equal to plus 3 centimeter and charge Q2 minus 6 nano coulomb is on y axis at y is equal to minus 3 centimeter. Calculate force on a test charge Q0 equal to 2 nano coulomb placed on x axis at x is equal to 4 centimeter. So, you have to draw a diagram. First of all, you have to draw a diagram. Quality diagram will decide. 1, 2, 3, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3. 1, 2, 3, 4. Yes. Where the charges are placed? Yes. How the charges are placed? Plus, yes. Plus charge is placed, y is equal to plus 3. This is 1 centimeter, 2 centimeter, 3 centimeter plus charge is placed at what distance? 3 centimeter. How much? Yes? Nano? 10 is to power minus 9 pool. The other one is what? Yes, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, negative charge. At what distance? minus 3 that is 3 centimeter long negative. What is the value for the same? This is Q1 plus this is Q2 minus 6 into 10 raised to the power minus 9 coulomb. So, it is an electric dipole fine in case required to find it is not required in this particular case to find electric dipole moment in case you need then charge which charge? either of the two because these are equal into distance between the two. Distance between the two is how much? 6 centimeter. It is not required in this particular question. Question here is you have to find out force on one more charge Q naught placed at 1, 2, 3, 4 centimeter. So, you have a charge Q naught value 2 into 10 power minus 9 coulomb placed at what distance? 4 centimeter, all are in centimeters, all distances are in centimeter. So, this is what is given. Given is what? Q1 plus 6 into 10 is power minus 9 coulomb. Q2 minus 6 into 10 is power minus 9 coulomb and Q0 is equal to 2 into 10 to the power minus 9.
you have to find out force on this. Anyone can help. It will experience force due to what? Why it experiences force? Because of positive? Yes, because of this positive charge, positive, positive L repel. So, let this force be termed as F1. What about the other one? Negative charge will attract it. Let this be termed as F2. Any idea about magnitude relationship of F1 and F2? Yes. Equal Y. Q1 into Q0. This charge and this charge is same. When you find force due to these two, this charge and this charge is same. So, magnitude of F1 and magnitude of F2 will come out to be same for solution. What you need to find? Net force on charge Q0. That is what you need to find out. Magnitude of F1 is equal to magnitude of F2 is equal to what? Yes. If this distance is R, any idea about this is 3, this is 4. This distance is what? 3 square plus 4 square and root comes out to what? 5 centimeter. Find F1's magnitude. 2 minutes with you. Draw the diagram find magnitude of F1, help. Charge Q1, other charge Q0 over 4 pi epsilon naught r square, try. 2 minutes to try. Q1 is how much? 6 into 10 raised to the power minus 9. Q naught is how much? 2 into 10 raised to the power minus 9. 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught is equal to how much? This value 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught. This is 9 into 10 raised to the power 9. It is a constant. In a plus 1 it was capital G. Here this constant is 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught. R 5 centimeter. 5 into 10 is per minus 2 square. Solve an answer. Yes, 4 point. Solve what you get is 4.3 into 10 is per minus 5 Newton. Correct? SI units. Step 2, you have to find out what? The resultant force due to these two forces. If there are two vectors A and B, how you find resultant of the two? A square plus B square plus 2 AB cos theta and root. This is 1. You can follow this. For that you will have to find out angle between the two. A relatively simple approach is T these two forces are equal. If this angle suppose is theta, this also theta. What is component of F1 along this line? F1 cos theta. What is component of this F2? F2 cos theta. F1 and F2 are equal. The horizontal component of F1 is F1 sin theta. In this case F2 sin theta. These two are equal and opposite, will cancel. So, the result is, yes, component of this is F1 cos theta, F resultant is equal to F1 cos theta plus F2 cos theta, F1 and F2 are equal. Magnitude of F1 is equal to magnitude of F2, that is where 2 times F1 cos theta 
f1 is known to you anyone cos theta is equal to what extend this this line and this line are parallel it is the same line in this triangle yes theta cos theta anyone in this triangle right angle triangle cos theta is equal to what 3 base by hypotenuse 3 by 5 2 into 4.3 into 10 raised to the power minus 5 into cos theta is equal to what 3 by 5 calculate resultant force magnitude comes out to be what 2 minutes for calculation. check this this value this is this value check please check this value is it same yes because it is a micro newton correct what do you get is yes 5.16 into 10 to the power minus 5 newton What about the direction? Yes, this resultant force, this is plus y axis, this direction is termed as j cap, unit vector along y axis. This direction is what? This one minus j, minus j cap, step 3. F resultant. Now we have to write magnitude as well as direction. 5.16 into 10 raised to power minus 5 Newton is magnitude. Direction is what? Minus A. Units 